Hello, this is Dr. Bob Demaria, and what I am focusing on right now are chestnuts. And you've heard the old song, chestnuts roasting on an open fire. I'm going to focus on one in the back that I already have an X drawn on the top. And the one to the right, I'm going to be showing you how you're going to cut a chestnut. You want a very, very sharp knife. And what you're going to do is you're going to just protect your fingers and you're going to get that knife and you're going to just put a, a break in it this way and you're going to put a break in it this way like that so it's going to have an X or it looks like a plus sign I normally will do anywhere from 15 to 20 chestnuts now here's the real nice aspect of them and I already pre-baked some for you I put them in a covered container and I put water on the bottom. Now I cook those chestnuts right there for 20 minutes at 325 degrees. If you look at the one on your right, you can see that that unfolded really nicely. So when I made that X, that's how it unfolded. And I put water on the bottom of a pan and I cover it, cook it for about 20 minutes or so. If you look at the one over here on the left, right here, that one did not open. Now sometimes, if you notice, this is a nice yellow skin right here. This brown husk did not come undone. You're going to have to peel that. That chestnut is very, very tasty, and you could use that, add that to your salad. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to take this chestnut like this, and you're going to peel it, and you're going to pop it out. And let me tell you, this is very, very delicious. If you look at this one I have here in my hand, it has it doesn't have that same nice yellow and if you look at the inside I'm not sure if I I would eat this one probably could be a little bit dry um, you want to peel that husk part off because it's not really tasty but this is a perfect chestnut it's gonna be really good for any holiday time I actually will put those on my salad so what you do just to debrief you're gonna take those chestnuts you're gonna put it a plus sign on the top part, the round part, penetrate really deep into the chestnut itself, put it in a baking dish, put about a fourth inch of water on the bottom of a pan, porcelain baking dish or whatever you'd like, and then cover it, bake it for 20 minutes to a half an hour. If it has brown husk on it, if it seems dry, I wouldn't eat it. The perfect chestnut looks just like that. Enjoy.